I think what we realized in the beginning before we decided to start it, we did a lot of talking. So we talked to the big buyers at General Mills, at Kellogg's, at Kraft. We had connections to them and we said, what do you guys think about this? You know, why are you using the conventional egg in the first place? And they usually would say, well, it's highly functional. It causes my muffins to rise, the oil and water to come down, to come together in the mayonnaise. And then so we asked, well, if there was something different that was a lot more affordable, but did the same thing or better, would you do it? And we just kept getting lots of yeses, and we'd always say, please don't BS us, for real. Um, so that's kind of how we got started, and, and then we started, you know, just small, like any, like any company does. And, and fortunate enough, once we got one, uh, the dominoes started to fall, and people realized that maybe it's a better choice. We're still in the midst of it. I mean, every day is a delicate time for us. Um, we're growing really fast. I think the time when I realized that we were probably uh, more than likely on the right path is when um, I woke up one morning and I had about uh, 12,000 emails from our, our We Care at Hampton Creek address. Um, we had gotten a certain amount of traction over the last few days and it had sort of pent up in the system. Um, and we had inquiries from small and medium sized food companies all across the world, moms with kids with allergies. And it felt like that we had tapped something, that he, we had pressed something that had really resonated with companies that just cared about saving money, which is just fine for us, and people who cared about other things too. And I, I thought, well, maybe we're heading the right direction now. So our chief competitor is unquestionably the conventional egg industry. So 1.8 trillion eggs laid around the world, 99% by the conventional egg industry. And I think the, the, the most potent way that they've shaped it is to say that no matter what we do, we have to be significantly more affordable because the egg is cheap. It's the cheapest, most abundant source of protein on the planet. So we always underprice our product by about 30% to the conventional egg and that more than anything shapes it and I'd say number two is we one of our core values is radical openness and we think the more we can let people inside of what we're doing the better that industry isn't always like that and that's, that's something we live by.